Okay, this is a Dell uh, 2010, 2014. It's a touch screen. It's a very nice, it's a seven. Two, three, three in the middle. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Four at the bottom. So, this is the memory section. So, I'm going to try to take it apart. Oh, okay. Just uh, Laptop to crack or open, as you can see here. So, trying to crack it open. Wow, oh, broke something here. You see this? Yeah. See these little plastic clip? We crack them open. And there we go. There we go. And then the whole thing just came off. Like that. These are the three three top screens. there CR2032 not even sure that that battery is still working this is the this may be the batteries yeah batteries Maybe something. Not sure what that is. But this this is probably the hard disk. I think. I think this is the hard disk that's connected to here. It says made in China. This is the fan. Not even sure if this battery is still good. This is the pen. See this pen? That's the pen. Okay, so. Now that I've got everything open, just gonna try to see what's going on here. Anyway, so this is the big battery here. Looks, still looks good. Maybe this is the. Just 
tape to this thing. Take a picture of this. So you can see this RAM is a uh, this memory card is an eight gig Samsung eight gig memory card. So I'm gonna buy one, uh, maybe sixteen gig, and pop it in here because there is only one slot. It only support uh, DDR. 3L, so that has to be the memory um, memory card DD3 DDR 3L. Okay, so this is the uh, memory. Like I said, so what you do is you try to lift this up, and you can see this memory card is already and lift this up is already coming apart. Basically, it's here. See, push it to the side. Push it to the side, and you can see this memory card pop up. You know, so that's how you replace this memory card. It's extremely easy. And this one, see how many uh, gigabyte RAM. This is the eight gigabyte RAM. 8 GB as you can see here so I'm going to try to buy this because this is the one here option key to see what's uh, to get into the BIOS and the display yes and then it's gonna continue to do this battery is reaching the end of its usable life I say yes you know so I may have a battery replaced um since Biron Inspiron 13-7359 uh system BIOS is the uh, 1.07.00. I probably should update the uh, BIOS program, but it doesn't matter. And uh, do, yes, continue testing. This is gonna uh, tell me estimated time left is about 10 minutes and 10, 11 minutes. Okay. So I'm just gonna let it run. You know, be patient. Let it run. Eventually, it will finish, and you will see a report. So we'll get to that in a minute, in a minute but uh, this is Inspiron 137359, okay? I don't know what that is, EPSA, build for you. Okay, here we go. So we got some problem here. It says, uh, continue troubleshooting the system with the information provided below. You have to go to Dell.com with technical support. Use a mobile device to scan the QR code to continue troubleshooting. That's a service tag. That's an error code. That's a validation. I use my mobile phone and scan this barcode, and it says I need to replace my memory uh, card. And the memory card, the parts are not available at Dell because uh, this is a, I don't know, five years old or four years old or three years old laptop. Additional errors will not be resolved. Continue testing. I'm going to say yes. And then here, repeating that again, validation A0847. I'm just going to say continue. And here it says A0847. just going to say continue, 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 because uh, it's all the same barcode. It's gonna say continue. Okay, now it's telling me that. Just let it run to the final report because that's what I'm uh, going to be testing completely. Finally, one or more error 
else were detected. Okay, great. Okay. So now here you don't want to hit this play play button. You want to go to here, the lower right hand corner, and hit that arrow key, the right arrow key. And here we go. You see the uh, diagnostic report here, and it says Dell EPS. Assessment 4302 service tag blah blah blah. Here it says my battery. Uh, you know it gives the system health. The configuration results in uh, system health and event log. So it this first uh, it battery and AC adapter uh, condition. My battery charge is 32 percent high. I'm actually connected it to the uh, battery power, okay, 120 volts, so it's uh, charging, and the battery health is only 50%, less than 60%, so it needs to be replaced. The voltage is um, about 12 uh, volts, because this is the midi volts. Uh, so the battery flow is... Um, 1.2 amps right now, okay, this is 12,084 is milli amps. Primary ba battery charging status is charging because I'm connected to the wall charge, 120 volts charge. AC adapter is a 45 watts adapter, okay, currently it's connected. So if I unplug from the wall power, 120 volts power, um, then it's not going to say charging. I'm not going to do that. And the processor fan is uh, high, is 4,000, almost 4,400 RPM revolution per minute. So here is the thermals, the temperature, CPU temperature, you know, and so forth. Now, this is the most important part. So here is the hard drive. Hard drive is good. Boot path is good. USB device is good. Integrated Wacom, good. Video card, good. But the primary battery, um, there is an exclamation mark, so this needs to be replaced. Charger, processor, fan, processor, and then the system management and the memory. So the memory is bad. So, you know, so I need to replace two things, primary battery and um, memory card. So... This is a touch screen laptop, so it's very nice, you know. Um, so it's very simple, just have to open this. You know, this is useless because this is basically you scan that, you get to the Dell.com website and tells you that the part is not available. So, anyway, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to shut it down. Shut down. Actually, I'm just going to heart shut off, hold the power button, and there we go, it's, it's off. I already unscrew the back. quickly disconnected okay so here we go so we're looking at the back and we can see you know one of these is the memory and this is the battery by the way this is the hard disk okay and uh, I'm not gonna touch that and let's see this may be the which one is the this is the this is the memory. So I'm gonna try to see if I can pop this up, but before I do that I wanna disconnect the battery. There we go. So the the battery is just disconnected here. So this is the forty three watt hours battery and needs to be replaced. You know, so I can probably find it generic. up and get this replaced. 